Hey, Dr. Brad Murray, High Performance Health. Uh, today we're going to talk a little bit about your shoulder health and how to open up the, the front aspect of your shoulder. By far the most common posture we see that leads to shoulder impingement, uh, rotator cuff uh, pathology, um, scapular dyskinesis, which is an improper moving of your scapula, is a rolling forward and a flexion of that thoracic spine. We sit a lot, we drive a lot, we ride a lot, we type a lot. This gives everything a, a flexor dominant pattern in through your chest. We want to make sure not only that we can help get those shoulders to tug back, but we can open up the front of the shoulder to allow those muscles to work up not quite as hard when they're pulling against the chest muscles. We want to open up that chest. So what we're going to do is we're going to do a pec stretch for that chest stretch, anterior delt, uh, pec major, pec minor, gonna really open up the whole area. Couple important keys to remember when you're doing this guy. Before you even start to stretch, you wanna make sure that you're able to retract and depress that scapula when that arm comes up. You don't wanna simply go in and try to pull open the chest. You wanna be activating those scapular retractors, depressors, as well as those muscles that tilt the scapula against the thoracic spine a little bit better. As you go into this stretch, we're gonna do a one arm version of the chest stretch. You're gonna put the arm up towards the wall. Before you feel like you wanna go ahead and do the stretch, you wanna pull that scapula back and down, then lunge forward into that arm while you feel those muscles of your back being good and active to help pull that scapula back and down at the same time. Activate the scapular retractors depressors, relax the front, pec major, pec minor, anterior aspect of your delt. This is gonna help open up that shoulder. It's gonna help you get away from this sort of flexor dominant posture and help you get closer to a neutral, um, help increase that thoracic extension and get that scap back and away and increase that space through the anterior aspect of your shoulder. Give this guy a try.